Okay. Hello everyone, my name is Mr. Castillo, and today we're gonna to be learning about two-step equations. And in order to do that, we're gonna learn the order of operations, and we're gonna learn what an inverse is. So first, we're gonna talk about PEMDAS. And so PEMDAS is an acronym that helps us remember the order of operations in which we solve an equation. And so first we start off with parentheses, then we have exponents, then we have multiplication and division, and these go together, and then we have addition and subtraction, and these also go together. And so an easy way to remember this is through a chant. And so you guys, are, I'm gonna do it first, and then you guys are gonna join me. So please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. Pem does, Pem does. All right, now your turn. Ready? One, two, three. Please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. PEMDAS. PEMDAS. Okay, so you might be wondering how we use PEMDAS. And so I'm gonna write down an example and we're gonna walk down through it to learn how it works. So the example is, and so this might look a little complicated at first. We have three times one, in parentheses to the square power plus two plus four minus four. But using PEMDAS, this becomes very easy. And so the way PEMDAS works is that we go in order of each one and we do the operations in that order. So we start off with the parentheses and we do everything that's inside it. So we cross off parentheses and we do this term right here. So three times one is three. And so now we have three squared plus two plus four minus four. Next we have exponents. So right here we have an exponent and three squared is, do you know Pammy? Nine. Nine, yeah. And so we have nine plus two plus four minus four is equal to zero. Um, next we have multiplication and division. And in this example, we don't have that, but we, the important thing is that we use these together. So let's say um, you have four times three divided by two then we start off from left to right. And so it doesn't matter which of them, like it doesn't matter the multiplication before division, we wanna go in order. So in this case, we do four times three first, which is 12 divided by two, which is six. And so that's the same applies for addition and subtraction. And so we just follow from left to right. So nine plus two is 11. And then we have plus four is 15. And then we have minus four is 11. And that's how it works. Next, we're gonna learn about inverses real quick, and then we're gonna actually get down to solving a two-step equation order. Uh, so an inverse is the opposite of an operation. And so, for example, if we have addition, the opposite of that is subtraction. And if we have multiplication, the opposite of that is division. And one thing to know is that the inverse of a number, so like let's say we have plus six, the inverse of that is uh, minus six, right? And the, the way we know this is because we want it to always equal to zero, but with multiplication and division, we want the number to equal to one. So like, let's say we have times one, or let's do times two. So we divide by two, and that gives us one. And so that's how we know uh, the inverse of each operation. And so now, we're actually gonna apply these to solve a second order, uh, two-step equation, sorry. So let's come up with an example. I have one right here, 2x plus six is equal to zero. And so the way we approach this is that we wanna isolate this term right here. And the way we do this is with inverse operations. And because we wanna work backwards, we're gonna take PEMDAS, but we're gonna work backwards. So we're gonna, instead of starting with parentheses, we're gonna start with subtraction and addition and work that way. And so we start off with these two terms first because we're working backwards. And so we have addition right here. So the inverse of that would be uh, a write up. Well, subtraction. Yeah. So we would subtract the whole thing on both sides by, by six. So we would have minus six, minus six, right? And so now this term will cancel out on this side. And on this side, we would end up with minus six. And now we have 2x is equal to negative six. Next, we have multiplication and division. And right here we have multiplication. So the inverse of that, Lauren, what would it be? 
Uh, what's the inverse of multiplication? Division. Yeah, so we would have divided by two, right? So we would have divided both sides by two, and now we have x is equal to negative three. And that's how you solve, solve a two-step equation. And the next step is to plug in your answer into the original equation to make sure that you have the right answer. So we look back at the original equation, 2x plus 6 is equal to 0. If we plug in this negative 3 into here, we have 2 times negative 3 plus 6 is equal to 0. And now we want to solve PEMDAS going in the correct order, right? Because we're not working backwards anymore. So we start off with, there's no parentheses, or I guess this is times negative 3. There is no exponent. We have multiplication right here, so 2 times negative 3 is negative 6. And we have addition, and so now we have negative 6 plus 6 is equal to 0, which is what we have. So that's how you solve a two-step equation. Thank you, everyone.